Worldwide, 2.9 billion tons of cement are produced annually and the trend is rising. The global CO2 emissions this causes are about four times higher than the emissions produced by worldwide air transport. Scientists at KIT developed a green process which preserves the excellent properties of cement as a binder while achieving massive savings of energy. This new cement is called sealitement. It has the potential to reduce considerably the worldwide emissions of carbon dioxide climate gas over the next few decades and in this way contribute to climate protection. These are the substances involved, silicon dioxide, calcium dioxide, water and carbon dioxide. To produce Portland cement, cement clinker is burned from raw meal. Carbon dioxide is driven off at temperatures above approximately 800 degrees centigrade. Tricalcium silicate is formed at 1415 degrees centigrade. Water must be added for cement to perform its functions as a binder. Three parts of water are required per one part of tricalcium silicate. This gives rise to two parts of calcium hydroxide and one part of calcium silicate hydrate. It is only calcium silicate hydrate which provides the required strength. The same feedstock is used to produce sealitement, but the ratios are clearly different. In this case, too, carbon dioxide is driven off at approximately 800 degrees centigrade. Next, sealitement is synthesized in a two-stage process at a maximum temperature of 300 degrees centigrade. The reaction of one part of sealitement requires half a part of water. This produces exclusively calcium silicate hydrate, the product giving concrete and mortar their strength. Scientists at KIT have designed and built a laboratory-scale facility for the production of sealitement, which they use for analytical studies and fundamental tests. In order to exploit the high innovative potential of the development, KIT together with the Schwenk Group founded Sealitement GmbH. This company studies and develops applications of the new cement. At the same time, it improves processes and facilities for its production. The long-term objective is to replace a material established for more than a century and with a lot of excellent properties by a modern, sustainable product and in this way drastically reduce carbon dioxide emissions associated with the production of cement.